What's going on guys, thanks for tuning to another video and today I'm going to show you how to get the Fraps screen recorder which I use for my gameplay, absolutely free, full version as well. So as you can see, I'm on a media file download, there'll be a link in the description so you can just copy and paste it onto your uh, browser and once you click on it, it's a media file download and it should come to here. I already downloaded it at the bottom as you can see here but I'm just going to download it again just to prove that it is this one and I'm uploading it at the moment as you can see on the top left hand corner a bit um, that's why it, sh it should it will take a while but it should take like a couple of seconds for you guys like 10 seconds or so but mine's going to take a while so as you can see I am actually using the fraps to record this as you can see on the top left hand corner you can see the FPS uh, when it's red that means it's recording I purposely you could hide that um, if you don't want to show your FPS um, but I didn't so I can show you guys how to use it as well once the download and the setup is finished so it's an easy setup download and setup is easy so it's done as you can see here you click on it and then it should bring you up to a yes um, so it should bring up to thing and as you can see here then it comes to this page so what you do you click I agree I'm not gonna click I agree because that when I click I agree that will stop my fraps recording but what you simply do you click you basically click I agree next next wherever for uh, whichever uh, you click on browse on whichever place you want to save your all your movies at once you've recorded or you can just leave it it normally saves on your documents and it should like make a fast order for you movies and it should uh, save everything in there so you click next and then you click finish and it should uh, say complete then you cross it out so once it's crossed out once it's finished it should you double click on uh, wherever you saved it um and it should also give an icon on the desktop as well and then you click on it and then it should bring you up to this so once you opened it 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 brings you up to this so this is the front general page i'll show you how to use it as well might as well so the first thing is stop uh, fraps minimize out i i just untick that fraps when they're always on top so I uh, that's normally the uh, default settings is always ticked out so leave it on and this one once ever you open it for the first time it sh is is unticked so you meant to click on that so you can um, monitor the area desktop so you can uh, basically record uh, your desktop what I'm doing right now um, so that's all you do for the general then the FPS so you can change wherever you save all your movies you can click change and save wherever you want to save your movies mine's at, at the moment is documents at fr f uh, fraps actually that's your benchmarks in it so fraps and then benchmarks so if I go on to let's minimize that real quick documents fraps and then benchmarks right here so these are all like whatever your f fps and frame times you can save well you, it just automatically saves it once you click um thing again so f11 for the benchmark thing i i normally my benchmark settings are always at fps you could put your frame times ticked on as well and then you could click on which one overlay corner so as you can see on the top left hand corner you can see it's red and it's showing my fps at the moment you can choose where to position that as you can see in the top right now top uh, uh bottom right bottom left so I normally like it on the top left but you can choose either and if you don't want to show your uh, FPS you can basically click hide overlay but just to make sure you can see if this is red then it's definitely recording if it's yellow then it's not and now it's gone but I'm gonna put it back just because I oh well, I don't really like using it well I'll hide it for actually I'll put it on now so I can show you how to use it so next option is movie so now this is the way you uh, save all your recordings so as you can see mine's on documents then my uh, fraps and movie so you can click change and wherever you want to save it so if I quickly go minimize that real quick if I go in my documents and then click on fraps and click on moves then all my movies are saved in there so as you can see you uh whatever your video cap settings 60 fps if you're recording for youtube then 60 uh, youtube allows 60 fps uh, uh now so you can click on that um so you click on before you used to allow just like 30 fps but now you can so you click on 60 um that all stays same 60 uh if you want to record your background sound basically windows 7 i'm using windows 7 but if you're using any win it works for any windows, windows 8 windows 10 this is this is absolutely the same for every windows but if you download it for windows 10 or windows 8 it will still say the win 7 sound but it's the same thing it just keeps the settings as win 7 because this was made for win 7 but it still works 
absolutely the same with Windows 8 and Windows 10. Um, then, yeah, so you tick on that if you want your background noise out, if you want to play music in the background, whatever you want to do, if you, uh, I don't know, whatever. So there, and then I put stereo, not multi channel. Uh, but stereo is fine for me. Then you're recording external output. That's basically your microphone which you use. So I would choose of mine. It normally detects which microphone you're using. I'm using this gaming one. Um, and then you can click. for thing and also as you can see my mouse cursor right now you can hide your uh, ma uh, mouse cursor in the video you can lock frame rate while recording but you don't you don't need to really much for slowness uh thing maybe so don't uh, don't touch that or anything i normally leave it on but if you want to hide mouse cursor you can the next thing is screenshot the last thing you can s as you can see i say man's at document fraps screenshots i don't th i'll show you so documents fraps and in the screenshots so i did screenshots there um, so you can say wherever screenshot so F10 is for screenshot and you can choose which image format you want in and you can just leave those here and I forgot one thing in movies F9 as you can see is to start the recording as well so that's basically it's a simple uh, fraps uh, simple screen recorder but is the like it's good it's like action if you know action screen recorders but this is much more simpler but if you did enjoy as you uh, uh, as you know the version 3.5 that's the latest one 3.5.99 but if you did enjoy make sure to give this a thumbs up if it helped comment down below and what other tutorials I should do because I did a lot of uh, tutorials um, lately recently um, so if you want any else tutorials I should show you then make sure to comment down down below subscribe if you are new I want to see more tutorials and yeah I'll see you guys in another video